The top-ranked team in 1A six-man KC played host to the Hewlett Red Devils on Friday afternoon. It was a great day for the Bucks and a not-so-great day for the Red Devils. Hewlett did come up with a nice play on offense to start the game. Joshua Stevens will air this one out, and it's caught downfield by Ethan Dykes for a nice gain, but the Devils just could not get into the end zone. Meanwhile, Casey had no problems getting into the end zone. First, it's Danny Ramirez getting the call and the ball. That will be the first touchdown of the day for the Bucks, and that put them in front 8 to nothing. Later on in that opening quarter, it's a wild snap from Hewlett, then a big-time scramble for the ball near the goal line. And when it is all said and done, Reese Stafford will make the recovery for the TD, and KC led 14 to nothing. More scoring from the Bucks in that first half of play. Aaron Cleveland will waltz into the end zone for another score. So very, very quickly, KC was leading 21 to nothing. Meanwhile, Ramirez was continuing to have another solid game. 146 yards rushing, by the way, and another TD. And it was getting one-sided at 27 to nothing. Still in the first half, Hunter Rouse will chuck this one to Ramirez for a score. Casey had over 400 yards of offense in the game, and the Bucks are 4-0 and this year and have won their last 24 games in a row with an 80 to nothing win over Hewlett. The Bucks will be at home on Saturday to take on Guernsey. Hewlett is 2-2 on the year, and next up will be a home game against Rock River.